Well, hello everyone. Welcome to session two of our Advent series where we are going through um, people in the church family, their favourite carol, as we're going to then dig into these on Wednesdays, uh, Tidings of Comfort and Joy. What a great title and what we need in this season. And I'm really excited to have my friend with me, Henry, an absolute legend. Uh, Henry, welcome. I agree. <laughs> Do you like my, my purple Advent lights? Looks awesome. <laughs> Thank you. I, Father Clive didn't quite step up with the lighting, so I thought I would you know, do true Advent. Um, so really? tell, us, <laughs> tell us about uh, the carol that you have chosen and why. Okay, I've chosen Hug the Herald and your Sing. What a song. Um, why? Um, first, the tune is lovely and... The lyrics are amazing as well. Love that. Absolutely love that. It is, it's probably like one of the most famous carols in terms of I love I love it as well. I think it's such a great carol. Is there a particular verse or a line or um just section that sort of stands out to you? You, you mentioned about the lyrics being something that you enjoy. Is mm. there anything that particularly stands out? So yeah, for me, I think I would say like the whole three verses are amazing, but it all builds up. So it kind of like looks like the third verse sums everything up. Like when it's started, like talking about like born that man, no more may die, mm. want to give us a second chance and stuff like those are nice words. Yeah, so for me, I've, I would choose the third verse as my favorite. Absolutely love that. Yeah, this, yeah. So good. So um, with our theme during this Advent season is tidings of comfort and joy. How does this carol bring comfort and joy to you or how can it bring comfort and joy to others who are listening back to this? Yeah, uh, I would just mention like we having the prophecy of Emmanuel, which means God with us and knowing that God has come to dwell among us in the third verse as well, it says, born, heaven born prince of peace. We know that he's come with as a prince of peace to bring about like peace and comfort in our everyday endeavor. So no matter like what persecution, no matter like what, uh, how it could look like or how confusing it could look like, we know that we have the prince of peace back in us. And also like he brings healing in his wings. Again, we suffer through uh, different sorts of diseases, different sorts of sicknesses, and f different areas of our life that we need healing. And this hymn kind of like reminds us that there is that provision. I think the worst part of life is like when you don't have a clue to how you get out of a particular problem. Yeah. But knowing that we've got a solution, knowing that we've got a solution in God coming in human form to dwell among us is comforting. Is comforting and knowing that he's come to give us more in that faith right that born that man no more may die so for me it's comforting that you know like okay all the things i feared all the things that gave me worry someone has kind of like looked at them and think okay my son i'm giving you comfort i'm giving you peace you don't have to worry about this anymore you don't have to like go through this pain anymore i'm giving you peace i'm giving you healing wow Wow, that's unbelievable. I'll, thank you so much for sharing that. And um, yeah, I, I love that aspect of the, yeah, peace is such, when we talk about comfort, and, you know, tidings of comfort and joy, peace is something in it. There's a peace within that brings comfort. Yeah. God's peace in Jesus Christ being revealed brings joy. And uh, yeah, I just love what you've brought out of that. It's making me think, and I'm looking forward to being able to explore that as part of the the, the discussion group later on on Zoom. So uh, thank you so much for, yeah, just for all your encouragement for the way you serve and the exciting things that are ahead, which we, little spoiler alert, we'll uh, tell people later. <laughs> <laughs> Not in this section. Maybe we could talk about tables. <laughs> 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 segue into that um, anyway uh before we get into trouble um i, <laughs> I want to say thank you so much brother and um you're just always a joy to be around and you are someone who brings tidings thank of you, joy to me so thank you for that um bless you brother and uh, we'll speak soon thank you take care